Hello and welcome to tgkmobile.com. This time with a tablet and a Hanvon BC10C really nicely built high performance and uh, high quality tablet. Really been enjoying the, the use on the sofa surfing mode. Let's go a little bit closer to see more about it and uh, play a bit with it so you can see also how it performs and, uh, and feels on the on the tablet use. Before tablet action let's first go around the device. We have the power plug there, up and down enter, uh, like a rocker there, works really nicely. Mini it's the MI out, wireless on off, power on off, five programmable keys, uh, two of them are brightness up and down, then you can launch browser media player and so on at least these three and the rocker are programmable with the third party software here's a left speaker nothing on the bottom and on the right side the right speaker microphone headphones uh, port for vga out dongle two usb2 ports and uh, the sd card slot kensington lock over there two microphones and vents over there then going to the bottom you see more vents rubber stands for table use and then small screws on each of the corner and under this sticker to access the hard drive and ram both are upgradable which is a nice thing of course and then here we have an optical mouse which has also click action so it's really nice you can click double click or click and hold for right click menu that's a nice thing and this is one of the best optical mouses i have used so i really i, I like this mouse it's a it's 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 a good and it has nice feature on the top normal lights for hard drive and wi-fi and so on and the basic webcam on the top the screen as you can see it's glossy Capacitive multi-touch, it's 10 inches and uh, 1024 by 600. And still not going to tell that action, I have to compare the device itself to other devices. Here is a typical 10 inch netbook. You can see it's actually a bit smaller than typical netbooks are and a bit thinner, especially with this Acer one, it's a nice size. Comparing that to even bigger devices. Here is the HP Mini 311. So compared to that, it looks huge, of course. So HP is huge and the tablet is small. And again, you can see the thickness over here. And final comparing to the Arcos Mini 5, which is really small, pocketable tablet. Of course, it's way smaller, but just to make you understand the sizes, here we go. Okay, so now let's go into the tablet axe and let's fire up Surface Globe. And while firing up, I explain why it's actually really nice on this device, because uh, Touchpad BC10Z, the model I have here, has the Celeron 1.3 GHz Intel Celeron on it, so the performance is fine. Helsinki, let's go to my hometown and play a bit with a club. Oh, we have to press the search to make it actually work. So performance wise, this is nice and I really think that tablets should have uh, good performance. Otherwise, they are not that nice to use. So. I have been really enjoying the performance on this device. Intel GMA4500 as a GPU, so good 3G action on that one. Liking that, let's play a bit with the pictures too. So I've been using many other devices and comparing this to those, the action, especially on multi-touch, is way smoother on this. So it's it's really performance device compared to many others this size that's that and let's finally play a bit with the 
Microsoft Rebound. That's a nice, nice uh, multi-touch game. So, of course, playing it alone is not that fun, but I will just briefly show how it works on this device. So, ooh, I'm not that good on it, but let's see. Okay, so multi-touch action on gaming, that's all, always fun. Let's stop it now. And uh, multi-touch action, of course, is the cool thing here, but also video playback. I think tablets are great for video playback too. So here we are playing 1080p uh, Coral Reef Adventures sample. So, as you can see, playing really nicely and skipping nicely. Good for videos. Okay. And as I was talking about the performance thing, let's go to system properties. So you see, oops. So you see how the how the performance is. So this is running Windows Home Premium and Windows Experience Index index for this device is 2.9 for CPU, 4.9 for memory, this has 2 gigs of RAM and uh, graphics 3.2, 3D, 3.2 and 5.8 for the hard drive. This has huge 300 gigabyte, 320 gigabyte hard drive, so that's a nice thing. Other uses for tablets, of course, eBoot greeting. Uh, I think uh, not that many uses ebooks on the on this kind of devices but uh, uh, on the pcs but uh, this is good for that if you hold it uh, on your on your lap or, or on your on your knees and as you could see i can rotate the screen by by flicks but uh, i could also also program one of the keys for the rotation but i'm using Penflix, which is built in in in, uh, in thing on the on the Windows 7, so ebook reading fully possible on this size of device. It's a it's a nice nice option too. But for me, especially, it's been best for surfing, YouTube action, and so on. So of course, YouTube plays perfectly. Let's play one of my own clips. There's Starbucks and me preparing live live session from the Sebit, so we'll bear with me. As you can see it's really really nice on the full screen view YouTube. Let's, uh, switch over to, to JK it's cool. Today, who's, uh... Yes. So YouTube, other surfing is fine. And uh, let's do some big side like Engadget. Let's do that just to show the performance. So immediately when it's loading, I can start scrolling. Actually, I like to scroll with thumbs like this. So it's it's good performance for that. If we open a new thing, you can see it's immediately ready for for action. So no need to wait. Of course, with the longer swipes you can get get it to scroll longer but anyways it's it's really nice and uh, mani manipulating the screen a bit more i have to show you this supports full tablet features so anywhere there is a uh, input field you can launch the keyboard nicely of course handwriting too but you can't use uh, pen on this one other than some kind of capacitive pen which i don't have but Drawing is possible with finger too. And let's move it back as a keyboard. So keyboard use, multi-touch uh, gestures and so on play nice on this device. Anywhere there is an input field, always keyboard pops up nicely. That's not the case in many other devices. So this, I think this is really important thing, especially in search fields. If you search something, it's just so much nicer to have the keyboard up when you need it. Summarizing the package, it's the high quality build, the really nice smooth multi-touch accent, the nice uh, video playback capability, 
also with the external screen from HDMI out, uh, the tablet features, full Windows 7 tablet features with a, with a fast CPU, so you really feel like you are with the, with the uh, pictures or whatever you're manipulating. Ebook reading, PDF reading on the 10 inch device is pretty, of course, uh, uh, if you're looking for a little bit less heavy device, they have the system model coming, which I will be showing you also soon. Uh, missing a stand, that's one thing I would like to see here, is building stand. And uh, precaution about the, the pre-production sample or production sample I have here, it's running all the time at 1.3, which means that the battery life right now is around three to three and a half hours. So it might be even more when it's, when it's fully uh, ready. Uh, compared to other tablets, really the pre-programmable keys, uh, really nice rocker uh, on, on, the pot, uh, on the top, I really like it. Uh, on the pricing and availability, I got the word uh, that it's available from starting from Asia at 25th of March and then coming to Europe and US starting price US dollars 877 which is around uh, 650 euros which is I think good price for the nice quality and uh, performance uh, more pictures full specs and uh, other information about this uh, tablet of course uh, from jkkmobile.com if it's not on the front front page search Hanvon and you get all the info. This uh, is one quality slate. I have been really enjoying playing with that and uh, especially especially the surfing surfing and videos. It's a it's a breeze, breeze to use a device with this this much power. So that was Hanvon PC10. Great new tablet and uh, we will see its system model soon too here at jkmobile.com but right now I have to have to continue my surfing here at the sofa because this mode is, is a good mode for, for tablets so more coming soon, some other tablets maybe too so keep your eyes on jkmobile.com thank you, bye